Hello everyone, I'm back on my anarchy world. You may have noticed that I've added an extra room to my house. This is my lotto room. I want to get one of every color of axolotl. I have three of them so far. I have the cyan, the pink, and the yellow. I actually made an axolotl spawn area to, to, to grow my room. I'll show you it right now. Also, I figured out how to take off with the, with the oven click. While just doing one jump, you just gotta hold down and then, bam! All right, so here it is. It's this large stone area. It's basically water covered in stone. It's not. It's simple but somewhat effective. Yeah, there's nothing here right now. I just had two trips where axolotls spawn, so it might take a bit for more to spawn. Yeah, if you don't know, axolotl spawn in water that is covered below Y level 63, which is why I have my coordinates on to make sure I was below the Y63. So that's what this thing is. Please play with me on this world. It's very boring. It's meant for multiple people, and I'm the only person who plays on it. Please. If anyone else joins, I'll probably just start recording a video. So I can mess around and have antics. Yeah, I have a bunch of phantoms because I haven't slept. Because I've been at the axolotl fault spawner. It also spawns glow squids, but I don't want those. <gasps> oh wait, it's not it's not one of the colors I needed. Whatever. I'm just gonna take this one anyways. I've decided I'm not going to put an axolotl in my axolotl room unless it's a color I need. Because my room is getting pretty crowded and I don't want to crowd all the axolotls. So I'm just going to catch this one and I'll figure out somewhere to put it. Oh no, I broke the roof. What are you doing? Where is it? It's right there. Come here. There. Alright, now i got to wait for one of the colors I don't have to spawn. Maybe, maybe whoever joins will give, will give the extra axolotls to have. Also, if you do get the axolotls, please make sure to put them in a covered area because they have a tendency to go on land, even though they can't survive on land. And I don't want them to die. Originally, I was looking for them in the ocean, but that was too ineffective, and it took too long, so I just made the spawner. Uh, I'm going to show you my prototype. It's over here in the river. It's very small and it doesn't really work. I still check it every once in a while. Yep, just as I expected. Empty. Yeah, and I didn't feel like making a bigger box, so I just found a lake to cover up. And that's how the axolotl form came to be. All right, let's check inside again. Just glow squids. Alright, let's take off and fly away so that everything despawns and then respawns. This gives me a nice time for a forest area. Here is a forest. I know the spawn island is around here somewhere. I kind of want to find that and show it. My house. I know this one area is in the street. You know, hey, a slime. Is this it? Yeah, this is this is the spawn island. There is a lectern and a chest and an anvil. And an exploded hole. <laughs> or what looks to be an exploded hole. Basically, this says, read the book. Welcome to the Queen Fangirl Anarchy server. You can use cheats and do whatever you want. There are almost no rules. The only rules are no racism, homophobia, transphobia, etc. We want this to be an accepting community. That, that's all the book says. Yeah, and there's a chest in the anvil right there. Alright, gonna go check on the farm again. I'm like green, but worth it building. 
<laughs> and redstone. I, I'm so bad at redstone, I don't understand it one bit. It's magic. I'm basically just green, but worse. Just one more. Come on, give me the lottles. That's those are not axle models. I'm just gonna You know, I'm just gonna set this axle model free into the ocean. Be free! And I'm going to get another bucket of water so that I can put another axolotl on it. And if you, I bet you're wondering, why don't you just spawn axolotls in? Because this way is more fun! It's more satisfying to catch one in a bucket, like actually like this, instead of just spawning them in. Besides, then you get to see what type they are, because it says the name of the axolotl you have in the bucket. Check on the lotto room again. Yeah, there are a lot of babies in the lotto room. What's the number of cyan? <laughs> There's so many cyan axolotls. They're the oh wait, no, I think I might have actually actually have more gold axolotls now. Yeah, because I brought a bunch of gold ones back. Yeah, it's kind of crowded. I don't know why they don't just like swim up and there'd be more room, but they're not the smartest axolotls, but I love them. My dog army has not moved since I told them all to sit because I don't, I don't really need them. I just one shot pretty much everything. The only thing I don't really one shot are like bosses, like the Wither, the Ender Dragon, or Elder Guardian. So well. actually, I haven't fought any Elder Guardians or the Wither yet, but I don't. I know I don't one shot the Ender Dragon. All right, time to check the farm again. We. And there's nothing, which means it's time to fly around a bit. Oh no, I broke the sign. You know, whatever. You, you. I'll just, if anyone wants to know what this is, just ask me. It's the axolotl farm. How you use it is you break the stone, get a water bucket, and capture any axolotls that are inside. Basically, it, it's a free to use farm because there's no point in me using it once I have all the axolotls I want. Unless I just want to make, like, an axolotl zoo. I actually did that in one of my worlds. I made, like, an axolotl sanctuary, a, a strider sanctuary, a parrot sanctuary, uh, and a wolf, and a fox sanctuary. I think that's going to be the end of the video, because this is getting boring, and I'm not finding any more axolotls, so bye.